What's up my Shuggies? Ashley here and in today's video I have an amazing massive haul from Figs. As many of you know, I am a scrub lover, not only because I wear them every single day in my profession, but I also am just a lover of them because they are bright, bold, beautiful, nice fitting, and super chic. So I decided to snag some of their newest, latest, and greatest options, as well as colors that they have come out with. They actually have revamped and added in some new selected styles, such as the high-waisted Zamora jogger, which I was super excited about. So I'm going to do a massive haul and try on of those. I am also going to be doing a little bit about scrub hats as well as a medical backpack. I guess you necessarily don't have to use it as that, but I use it for my everyday work bag. Also stay tuned to the end of the video because I'm going to give some final thoughts. I did a couple of different purchases. So this is a culmination of multiple purchases from Figs. So I have some thoughts that I wanted to run by you guys, just in case you were going to purchase any or all of these items. I want to make sure you have all of the information you need before doing so, so you don't make the same mistakes that I did. I also want to welcome my new subscribers. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And if you are interested in seeing this amazing figs haul, as well as medical accessories, then just keep watching. Right, you guys, before we get into the haul of the figs and the scrub caps, I wanted to go over my what's in my bag. This is a backpack that I use every single day for work. I personally love a backpack because I am always on the go. I have a ton of things in my hands. One of them may be coffee. And I always want to keep my hands free, so I opt for the backpack. This one in specific is from an amazing company called Happy Teeth. And this, you guys, is what we call a medical backpack. So for any of those people out there that are like me and they're in the medical field, whether you are in the medical sales field, pharmaceutical sales, nurse, CRNA, doctor, whatever the case may be, this is a great option for you. It is massive. It is made of this amazing material that feels extremely durable. And then on the back here, you have a lot of support as well as these straps that have this really nice additional support and foam inside. So I'm just gonna kind of jump through and go through a small, quick what's in my bag. Um, it has a ton of different compartments in it. I do keep my glasses in there for when I'm in cases and I can't see because I'm nearsighted. And then in the front here, this main big pocket, I like to keep, you actually can keep your lunch and stuff. I keep my business cards in here, but there are pen pockets and it's actually insulated. If you can see here, you can actually put food items and it will keep them and store them to make sure that they are either hot or cold. And then in the front here, as you can see the super seamless zipper here, which I love, it is just a massive compartment. And I keep a ton of stuff in there, including my massive dinosaur laptop, as well as my favorite planner of all time. You guys, this is from Target. I have to show this to you. If you are OCD and into planning like me, but you don't like the stereotypical day-to-day, um, month-to-month calendar, you just want something um, that you can customize, these are great. They're from Target. And as you can see here, half the side is just notes. The other half is an actual schedule only with the days. No dates. No nothing, it's blank, it's clear, it's simple, it's to the point, so this is completely customizable. I love this, I use this every single day. I literally cannot work without this because it keeps my week organized, especially when I'm pre-planning and um, doing vacations and meetings and all of those sorts of things, it really is amazing. They're super cost effective, I think I paid around seven dollars for them they have all of these cute little sayings on the top the other one that i got had lips all over it um but it has this kind of like plastic sheet over top of the paper and this one says good things are coming yes i agree with that so um i will link these below for you they're from target i've only found a couple of them online like two different prints so definitely get them if you can find them um, I will also say for this massive compartment, this is like the main compartment on the inside, there is a Velcro piece that you can put here to separate it and just put smaller stuff in the top 
um, third or top quarter of the bag, but I took that out. I like to keep it nice and open and put the majority of my stuff in here. And then in the back here, there is another zipper where you would, I guess, normally put like your um, iPad and stuff like that, which mine's charging. But in here, I put all of my chargers. So they're in the back, they're out of the way, they're in their own separate zipper. And then I just have my main stuff in this main compartment. They also have a part on the back. You can put it on a suitcase. They have a side compartment where you could put your drink, your water bottle, any of that stuff. They have literally thought of everything. It is an amazing backpack. I will link it below for you guys. There is a code for, I believe, $20 off. I'll link all the details below. So if you are in that world and you understand how much stuff you have to keep on you constantly because you're a walking office, you understand, I will link it below for you guys. Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the figs try on and haul. Okay, we are here with our first set and this is the chalk pink set from figs. And as you can see, this is very bright and beautiful. It has a beautiful corresponding tie. It is like a really, really nice, orange red color and I wanted to show it to you because if you have been with figs as long as I have there was another blush pink color that they came out with that I wasn't sure if this was the exact same or different so I will show you that next so you can see the comparison of the new one versus the old one as well as the red but for now I wanted to show you the chalk pink this is what the top looks like I always get the Katarina top in a size extra small because their tops do run big and then I also got the Zamora jogger which is another classic in a size small regular I did not get the tall and I do not get the petite I am right under 5'8", so I just get the regular length. I do have um, one pair, uh, the Red In Fact, that is in the longer length, but I honestly feel like it's probably too long and the regular is just fine. Um, I did wanna show you what the top looks like untucked so you can see for those of you who are concerned about sizing. I also have listed all of my uh, measurements and sizing in the description box down below. So as you can see, even though this is an extra small top, it does have the slits on the sides and it is a little bit longer. Um, I have gotten the regular small before and I just feel like it's too big and baggy. I really like the way that this one fits and the length of the extra small. So if you are interested in getting it, if there are any still available, this is what it looks like. And again, I will show you next a comparison of this against the older, um, I would say mauve pink color. So this to me, it is um, a muted pink, but a bright muted. Uh, so I'd say like a bright muted mauve, if I had to say, um, compared, especially compared to the older color. Um, that one is definitely more muted. I also wanted to take a second to talk about these hats. I have been really into scrub hats lately and found some really good ones. This is the same exact brand as the leopard print that I have, and they're really nice. It's almost like a silk like material. It does have the sweatband underneath as you can see here and also the buttons on the back so you can attach your mask and you don't have to worry about constantly having it be too tight or around your ears. So this is nice. It covers your ears and then your mask kind of goes over top. So I wanted to show you some options, not just for scrubs, but scrub hats as well for those that are in the OR and like me that always have to wear them all the time. Um, I will leave it below. They are from Amazon. They are very affordable and they come this particular brand in a couple of different color patterns, not a ton, but I'd say a couple of different, maybe five or six, and I have two of them. And then I will show you my Old Faithful, which is a classic black that I love. Um, it's from a different brand, but I wanted to show you this because this is a newer brand I've really been trying out and loving. And of course, the brand new limited edition chalk pink fig scrub. So I'm going to show you the other color. So in case you have one or the other, you can see them side by side. Now on the flip side, here is the old classic pink. I think this is a more muted mauve color. This happens to be my favorite. I do feel like it's coming off a little more pink than it actually is in real life. It truly has that milky pink hue to it. I just lowered the light a little bit so hopefully that helps but it really is that I would say rose type pink and I love the fact that it's got these maroon ties to it it's really a nice touch that they added a really nice contrast this also is the hazma top 
so this is not normally the one that I get to go with it, but in case you were wondering, with the two pockets, this is what it looks like, a very nice small um, V-neck on it, and the same classic Zamora pants in the size small with the zippers on the side. So this is what this looks like, and we are moving on to the brand new colors. Okay, next up is the pop red color, and as you can see, unfortunately, these just are two different color variations. I I don't know what I was thinking when I purchased them. I only got the top thinking that they re-released this red color, but unfortunately, that is not the case. This pop red color is totally different from the old red color that I have, as you can see here, and... Yeah, so unfortunately I'm gonna have to return this top. I was hoping that I could get it because I have this top in this color in the Raffaella uh, style and I wanted to get the Katarina style. So my thought process was, oh great, then I'll just get the top and I'll have two different red tops for my red pants. Wrong, um, two totally different shades as you can see here. So I'm going to have to return them because um, as I went back online, now the pants are sold out. So even if I wanted to get um, both sets, I couldn't because now the pants are sold out. So for all intents and purposes, I wanted to show you in case you were smart enough, unlike me, to get both pieces just in case they were a different red because in fact, they are. It is a very beautiful red. However, it is extremely bright. As you can see, this one is a little bit more of a muted, more of a fall red color. Um, I feel like this red would probably match more skin tones than this. This is extremely bright, almost has like an orange hue to it. Um, it is very beautiful, like I said, but very, very bright. I also wanted to show you these more joggers because these are the ones that I got in long. So if you are around my height, then you can see that they have a little bit of room at the bottom right around that ankle piece so I definitely think if you are anything like 5'9 and less you'd probably um be totally fine with that but I'd say like maybe 5'9 and a half or closer to 5'10 that I would definitely go ahead and get that longer length but I wanted to show you because this is the only pair that I have in that longer um tall length um as far as pants goes so this is a bust for me unfortunately I don't know why I just didn't get both pieces, but I wanted to show them to you so you can compare. If you have the old ones, um, let me know what you think in the comments down below if you like the old or the new better um, in the red and in the pink. And here we are with the Zamora high-waisted jogger pant. You guys, this is it. If I literally could just get rid of all of my other pants and have these, I totally would. Look how high-waisted these are. This is my belly button. This is where the pants are. It is phenomenal. OMG, I am obsessed with this waist height right here and the fact that they are the classic Zamora jogger style. I absolutely love these. The um, waistband is also different in the fact that it is a all around stretch, more of a sporty waistband versus the regular um, thicker cotton fabric waistband. So it does have a little bit more of that sporty look to it. Um, I did get both of my regular sizes and I am not complaining. It's actually very nice and comfortable as far as fit, but it does feel a lot bigger than um, my regular um, sizes before, like a lot more just like comfortable and roomy. Whereas I feel like the other ones, I don't know if it's because I've been washing them so much because of COVID that they're like shrinking and like not fitting my body now, but I'm really loving this color, this style, this everything. I'm so jealous that all of my Zamora joggers are not in this style because this is amazing. And this is my regular size small and it just, I don't know, it fits in. It feels like so much more comfortable. Um, it might look the same on camera, but as far as, you know, things, the way that they feel, this feels a lot better. I also am obsessed with these bright neon green ties. I think this was the literal perfect combination of a color to go with the cement gray color. Um, I don't know, maybe you guys can tell me if this was something that they came out with before and it sold out, um, or if it's just brand new altogether. 
in either case, I love it. I'm glad that I was able to snag it and I will link it below for you guys so that if you have the chance, you can snag it for yourselves. Now, I will say too, with these limited edition colors, they did also have limited edition styles. So they didn't have all the normal styles. They just had a few different um, styles in the tops and a few different styles in the bottoms. Now, with that said, they did have some really nice, unique new styles in the tops, but you know, basic Betty over here just wanted her classic Katarina, so that's what I got. I got the Katarina top and the high-waisted Zamora joggers. I don't even know if the regular waisted um, Zamora joggers was an option, but in any case, these are the jam right here. So I will post everything below for you, and I have one more brand new color to show you. And here is the last bright color, and again, of course, with this lighting, it's not showing a true representation of what it is but this looks like the OR green. However, it is not. It is a mint green color. It literally reminds me of that Andy's mint candy that I'm sure you all are familiar with. Um, I do like them, however. I just noticed when I put these on because these are the regular Zamora joggers, not the high-waisted, that these are tighter. So there's something to that high-waisted color I'm sorry, the high-waisted style that must make them bigger because these feel very tight. So I guess that's kind of a drawback. I don't like the inconsistency in sizing. Um, I would much rather have, you know, consistency. So if they're all gonna be on the tighter side, then they're all on the tighter side. So I guess that's not a figment of my imagination. I guess washing them, they haven't been shrinking. It's just must be that the regular Zamora jogger is going to be tighter and fit than the high-waisted because I feel a huge difference in my thighs and in the rear section. So this is the mint color. I did get the Katarina top and the Zamora jogger both in a size uh, small and extra small, and I really do like it. I think it's nice. It's coming across like an OR green, but let me brighten it up so you can see a little, but it really is more of a fuchsia tie here, and I'd say more of a minty green, not so much um, an OR green. So if the pants fit more like the other ones, I would definitely keep them, but I'm not 100% just because these feel like borderline uncomfortable. Even in the calves, they feel tight. So I'm definitely going to have to do some research into that. I don't really like that they're not consistent with their um, sizing. So if you're in between sizes, definitely size up. Um, as you can see, I don't know if you can really tell a difference. However, the color is really beautiful. I love the color. It's really nice, bright, and they have, of course, like I said, those corresponding bright orange ties, which are really, really nice as well. Um, in person, it's not picking up. These are literally like blinding. Like, this is not doing them justice. They are blindingly orange. So, I will link these below for you guys as well so you can check them out for yourselves and see what you think. Figs is really coming out with some good colors. I just wish we could have some consistency in sizing. But let me know what you guys think, especially in comparison to those first two that I thought were the same release of the pink and red, but were unfortunately totally different. All right, you guys, that is going to wrap up this Figs haul as well as medical accessories. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I did want to give you a couple final thoughts on those scrubs because I did do a separate purchase just in the Zamora high-waisted joggers. And you guys, I am so sorry to say, I am super disappointed in the sizing. I have had to make three different returns so far, which is a huge pain for me. Um, I don't know what it is. The gray literally fits like a glove. I love the small. It is perfection. It's a little bit baggier, like I said in the video. And then a little bit more loose-fitting and comfortable than the regular Zamora joggers. So I'm good with those. The navy blue... And the black, they were so tight in the small. Like, I had marks on my stomach just, like, right after I tried them on, uh, walked around the house a little bit, and then took them back off. Like, it was insane how much of a size difference there was. And these are all three smalls. Now, in addition to that, I also got the Royal Blue, one of their classic colors that I absolutely love. It was one of the first colors I ever owned in figs. And that size was more comparable to the gray. So I don't know if they're brighter, lighter, different colors, 
are true to size and then the staple colors like the navy blue and the black are gonna run really small but it's very confusing and very frustrating to be perfectly honest with you because who has time to make 20 different purchases and 20 different returns you know what i'm saying so i hope this helps you if you love the high-waisted some more joggers just be aware that the classic colors the navy blue and the black run very small so you're definitely going to have to size up to a medium if you are my size in those and then when it comes to the royal blue and that new slate cement gray color i would definitely stick to the regular small size if you are my size as well i hope this helps you I would say if I were you, worst case scenario, order every single size, small and medium or medium and large in every single color you think you would want and then just make one return because the returns are free. But unfortunately, your girl made three or four different purchases and now I have to make all these returns because nothing is the same size in the high-waisted Zamora joggers. So beware of that. I hope that helps you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and hit that post notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I upload new videos. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.